capillary action is the way that water, because water is a polar molecule, it's water's attracted to water. It behaves like it has this electrical nature to it where opposites attract. So it's kind of like if you take the, um, the edge of a Kleenex and you dip the corner of a Kleenex into a glass of water, just, just the corner of it, water will rise up through the Kleenex. And, oh, nice and that analogy, it's rising Chris. up through those. Yeah. It's rising up through those little hollow fibers of the Kleenex. They're little tiny hollow fibers, right? And they rise up through there, what we call capillary action. Exactly. That's a, I really like that analogy. That's a very good one. And so, you know, what we're going to picture here is that we have a stack of Kleenexes you know, layered on top of each other and we put a little water on the bottom one and it can go all the way up through these layers of Kleenexes. And if, if the top is frozen, the water will go hit that free, hit that freezing front and it'll freeze. And we could actually produce an ice wedge in between layers of the Kleenex in, in between the stacks of the Kleenex. Right. Which gives you a much more efficient lifting. Exactly. Exactly. 